Today's Out of the Darkness Walk in Goleta was part of a nationwide movement by the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention to shed light on mental health. News Channel reporter Mino Hobb spoke to attendees about the importance of raising awareness about suicide prevention. Dozens of people showed up to Goleta Beach Park to express solidarity with those who have lost a loved one to suicide. It was extremely emotional, especially with mothers. I have my son with me. I hope if he ever has any thoughts like that, I hope he'll remember something like this and he knows that he can talk to me about it. People like Desert Ahana walk two miles along the coast to honor their lost loved ones. This is a cause that's very near and dear to my heart. I've lost friends and I've seen a lot of people struggle. Those who attended wore multicolored necklaces called honor beads that represented who they were honoring on their walk. We have beads for loss of veterans, loss of siblings, loss of parents, loss of members of your community, and, and many others. Many people like Ray Fuller have been participating in the Out of Darkness walk for years. Our son uh, died by suicide 10 years ago. Uh, time doesn't pass that quickly. Fuller says that the way he honors his son is by trying to make things better for other people who are struggling. He and his wife find the two-mile walk to be therapeutic. Even though we're kind of crippled up, <laughs> can't make the whole walk, uh, we hobble along for as much as we can, and uh, it does it makes us feel better. Many advocates say that suicide prevention work starts by destigmatizing the word suicide. Suicide is something that we may not ever be able to fully eliminate. But if we can talk about it, we've got a really good chance. Saturday afternoon, the annual Out of Darkness walk in Goleta raised $16,000 for suicide research. In Goleta, I'm News Channel reporter Mina Wahab. If you or a loved one are experiencing thoughts of suicide, self-harm, or any mental health crisis, call or text 988.